So we are at Bato Cigars in Binion, right outside of the poker table. We're gonna go in. I, I bought this. So Sarah Vato and Paul Vato are the owners, and she makes this beautiful jewelry. So of course I had to indulge. And then it's just a little shop. That's my hubby. They, I crack them up. This is Paul. Hi, Paul. Hello, and welcome to Bato Cigars, located inside Vivian's Casino in classic downtown Las Vegas. Woo! Now, today I am going to be smoking the Luau. The Luau. It's part of our Aloha blend. Ooh. It's a very nice, medium to full body Maduro cigar. It's a San Andreas wrapper mm -hmm. uh, with a blend of Honduras, Ecuador, and Dominican tobacco on the inside. So the filler and the binder, and then a beautiful Ecuadorian, uh, oh, I'm sorry, uh, a beautiful San Andreas Maduro wrapper. Ooh. And that's our Luau, part of our Aloha blend. I'm excited. And, and people ask, like, does it have Hawaiian tobacco? No, it does not. Uh, it's our homage <laughs> to Hawaii, and Sarah's, uh, Sarah and I love traveling to Hawaii. So it's our homage to them, to their black sand beaches. They reminded us of a Maduro cigar, and that's how we came up with the name Aloha Blend. Awesome. Well, I am very excited to see We're on Fremont Street. We're heading over to Four Queens to a cigar lounge over there so we can smoke over there. Welcome back. As you just saw in the previous video, um, I introduced you all to Paul Vato. He is one of the owners of Vato Cigars and Binions. Um, he told you what the blend was today, and he didn't write it down for me. This one is called the Aloha Blend, the Luau, Luau Churchill. Um, and he let you know everything that was in it, San Andreas, uh, Ecuadorian, I think I can't remember the rest. <laughs> um, we are at a little craft brewery, kind of catty cornered across the street from Binion's at Four Queens. Four Queens is the, the place that we're in right now. And that's where you're allowed to smoke our cigars. So that is where this episode of Lady Cigar Review is going to be today. So let's get to cutting. So there's a little pigtail into it. We're just going to cut that right off. And then go super deep on the cut because I want to kind of give it a, give it a try. Um, I did stop at a Davinoff little kiosk slash pop-up that was at the um, Paris Casino today and I did buy a, a little Davinoff as well. But unfortunately I have a Zycar which is a high powered lighter and I cannot travel with that because they will just take it and steal it. So um, I'm reduced to matches on lighting my cigar so wish me luck. <laughs> One down, 20 to go. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Oh my god, I'm terrible at this. Stop. Oh wait, I got it, I got it. Oh. Oh. Thanks for the assist, honey. He's my co-pilot today. That's my husband, Dan. I hate lighting with matches. I don't like the flavor. I hate lighting with matches too. So half of it's lit. It's driving me crazy. Oh, okay. Hold on. Can I show you? We have flaming 
bridge. Okay. You know I always kind of work it a bit. It's a little stiff in the middle, but it's nothing that a little a little work won't won't work. Work won't work. Work won't work. Work won't work. Yeah. So, for some of you, I did go full Vegas. Look at this. I got fake eyelashes on. What? Yep, I did it. And the only other thing, ooh, sorry. The only other thing that I think is wonderful about Vegas, especially being in this lounge, is that I have a tasty beverage. I just went straight up cran cranberry vodka. I don't know if the sweetness of this will affect my cigar taste, but but let's get to smoking. Right out of the gate, you get bitterness. First off, yeah, it could be the love. You get you get a little bitterness from the uh, matches. The matches might like be giving me a little bit of that, but it's not it. it's not a bad bitterness. It's just that I get a little bit of spice tip of my tip of my lips. My, even my Fuente, the smoothest of the Fuentes is a little, uh, it's got a little chemically taste from the... My Fuente man is definitely feeling it a little bit too. So if you want some more views, I can help fix that. Hey, hey, hey! I did try to do a bathing suit one for you guys today. Um, and we were allowed to smoke at the pool, but there was just way too many people and I didn't want to be one of those people. It's definitely a full body. It's good. Um, I'm liking the heat. There's definitely some spice going on. We'll do our ash contest. I had just tapped out like a quarter of an inch. I see, I, I'm competing against myself to see how long I can get the ash without dropping all over myself, the floor, the chair, random people, you know, wherever the ash goes. Sorry, I'm cutting my head off for you guys. But here's my setup. So normally I've got it set up to where you can see my whole body. But because I have this little bitty short table and I've angled it up, let's see if I can angle it up a little bit more for you. Ooh, it's just so gutted. All right, we're gonna try to correct the lighting or correct the, the burn a little bit. Let's try this. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, at least. Well, I'm gonna continue smoking and I'll let you know how the flavor changes. Right now, spice definitely is starting to heat up even more. Um, I got the bitter at the beginning, it is saying, so I don't think it's necessarily the uh, matches issues. Um, other than that, yeah, so far so good. I will continue smoking and let you all know. Flavor-wise, it's great. Uh, it's still a little bit of spice, but um, the bitterness is mellowed out. Uh, it has almost a little bit of a creaminess to it. Uh, it's just really smooth, uh, but also a little complex, which I'm kind of really digging. So far, so good. I'm really liking this. This is actually the first time. I've had Vado cigars before, and anyone that asks me or tells me that they're going to Vegas, I always tell them if I know that they're a cigar smoker to stop because people I always tell them to go to Vados in Binion's um, the customer service is out of this world they're super friendly um, I love it everyone always comes to Vegas and goes to the Fuente store it's over in Caesars um, and it, they don't even 
some people don't even know about the Vado one. So I always make sure I tell people about Vado cigars. Um, you can't beat the customer service. They're super friendly. Um, they have other cigars other than their own home brand. Um, so you can get Fuentes. You can get... I know it's a couple of different ones. Maybe some Rocky Patel. There's some Rocky Patel. Um, the big names. There's big names, so you can get those as well. Um, so far, really good. I've always had the lighter ones in the bottom cigars, uh, but I've never had a Maduro one of those. So, so far, I'm really liking the Maduro one, which is a good thing. So, I'm going to keep smoking. Hopefully, we can keep our ash a little bit longer, and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I'm about two inches in. It's definitely getting wobbly and it's got a little dip to it, so we'll see. Might be losing it soon. lost it until I looked down and realized it was gone <laughs> Ooh, blah, blah. but it made it almost two inches and I didn't get it physically on me I just got it on the floor <laughs> sorry guys it did pretty good though um, it's burning beautifully no construction issues whatsoever um, I think I could have went even longer with the ash, but it's talking and not paying attention. And when I talk, I tend to gesture a little bit. So. And I'm loving my pretty bracelet that I got. It is rose quartz. It's supposed to give me love. <laughs> I already have my love. I love. <laughs> he really does like me even though he makes his grumpy faces every time I point a camera at him. This is our 12 year wedding anniversary tomorrow. So that's why we're here in Vegas. And then my here, husband is here for a conference. So I am doing Vegas and he is doing the conference during the day and then we hang out and do dinner at night. But tomorrow we will be married 12 years. And I still like him, which is a good thing. <laughs> you still like me, honey? You're on camera, do you still like me? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, he guesses. He still puts up with me. I'm already gonna tell you, I'm, I'm only halfway through. A little less than halfway through. And I already know I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. Um, I've liked it so far from the beginning all the way to the middle. So, good start. Really good start. I have not played any slots yet. I will do one slot tomorrow. Hopefully continue my streak. Every time I've been in Vegas, I've done one or two slots and that's it. And I've never lost money. I've always won. So, but I do one or two slots. I'm up. I go cash out. I'm not a huge gambler. Alright, so I think I'm going to call it because I am well into it. Uh, it's definitely starting to get a little bit more spice to it, but thumbs up. Definitely love it. Would definitely get it again. I highly recommend you come to Binion's and you see the Vatos and get one of their cigars, one of their house cigars. Below, you can like, subscribe, hit that little bell button so you can get all of my updated uh, cigar videos. I will also be doing another series on this whole weekend, uh, a travel video. So make sure you link and watch that one as well. If you have any questions or comments, please put them below. And thank you for watching. And as always, happy smoking and suck it!